One thing I did notice about this lake is you've got to get that bait right there on the fish. They seem to can't see very far, so you've got to really put it on his nose in order for that fish to see it. A little bit better fish there. I'm in uh, 17 foot of water. That fish was sitting about 10 foot down. Another just solid little fish, slam full of eggs, super fat, super healthy. All right, so this is my go-to rig. Um, I fish this basically all the time. Um, I'm gonna start with just a rubber bobber stop. Um, pull that onto the line, get it out of your way for right now. Um, the wind's blowing pretty good today. So I'm gonna go to a pretty heavy weight. Uh, this is a 3 8 ounce tungsten bullet weight. I'm just gonna thread it up on there, let it slide up. Um, then I'm gonna come back with my rubber bobber stops and I'm gonna put um, two or three of them below that weight just to where it doesn't slide down on the hook set. Two should be plenty. Um, now that's just gonna peg that weight on the line. Um, so I'm gonna use a, start with this. It's a pretty bright little bait, um, golden orange. It's always usually a really good muddy water color. Um, I strictly tie a polymer knot. It's a super strong knot. It's got two strands of line through that eye. And a um, fishing 15 pound fluorocarbon line. Um, I like clear line. I feel like the fish can't see it. Um, most of the time fish aren't very line sensitive, but I think in rare occasions they can be. So I just fish clear all the time. Find some clippers, cut that tag. Then I'm just gonna slide my weight back down. Um, I like to fish that weight mm, eight inches above the jig, I would say. Uh, something like that. that. That bigger weight helps you get that little light 30 second ounce jig down to the fish. And so yeah, this rod is 16 foot long. Uh, my preferred rod. I, I fish basically a 16 all the time. Um, obviously a cork handle. I love a cork handle. It just feels good to your hand. Um, I've got it rigged right now with a with a 30 second ounce hair jig, small little little hair jig. I've um, got a 3 8 ounce tungsten bullet weight just pegged right there, um, about eight to ten inches above it. I'm fishing 15 pound fluorocarbon. That's that's my go-to line all the time. And uh, got got it spooled up with a little cheap bait caster here. That's my preferred reel of choice. I like how quick I can make adjustments with it. As you saw earlier, most time I'm fishing with that line in my hand anyway. So if I need to you know, drop it a few inches, I just drop with my line instead of having to use a reel. Um, it's basically just a line holder to me. That's my rig.